Hey guys, this is just a quick prediction video on Modern Warfare 3 as I am really looking forward to the release of this as the Modern Warfare series is one of my favourite Call of Duty series. Uh, it's been going for a while now, it was developed by Infinity Ward and this year it's going to be developed by Infinity Ward as well. I know there was a video put out on YouTube that says Breaking News uh, Modern Warfare 3 co-developed uh, by Sledgehammer Games with Infinity Ward, but this is a lie, uh, Sledgehammer, Sledgehammer are going to be making a Call of Duty game, but it has been confirmed that it will be separate from Modern Warfare 3, whether it's just a DLC or an actual other game, I don't know. They haven't confirmed much yet, but I'm just going to give some quick gun predictions, as we know it's made by Infinity Ward, so it's pretty obvious that standard guns that we saw in uh, Call of Duty 4 and Call of Duty 6, uh, yeah, they're going to be coming back. Like, not all of them, but like main ones like uh, the M16, the Barrett 50 Cal, I'm pretty sure that those two will definitely be in there. You can have um, another prediction, but as far as special weapons go, I wouldn't expect to see anything that's uh, so out there. They could copy Treyarch and do a uh, ballistic knife sort of thing, but... I don't think they will somehow. I think they'll just stick to their their main guns that they've been using throughout the series. And as for release dates, uh, we know that Call of Duties are generally released from the November 1st period to the December 31st period, depending on... Um, to December 31st, sorry. Not period. Why did I say period? But depending on the um, whether all the testing and everything that they've got to do to get all the bugs out. I know Black Ops, they, uh, the bugs in that, they're still trying to fix because they kind of ran out of time when they were making it. So I hope that they spend a little bit more time on this, but they have about two years to make each game because uh, Infinity Ward does a game one year and then uh, Treyarch does another game another year because of um, Activision, they have a deal. If you go and watch a series on YouTube called The History of Call of Duty, that's really good. And if you hear any background noise, I'm sorry, I'm trying to record this and my brother's yelling. I'm so sorry. But that's about it. I will go more in depth. Uh, in depth. I can't pronounce that, but anyway. I'll go further into it um, as it gets closer to the release date. And thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new, as I really need subscribers. need to get my videos out there. Okay, thanks for watching. See you later, guys.